we we right to sit here? Yeah, that's fine. Come and sit sit oh, down. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. What is it that you two do? You don't look like you're from around here. We're climbers. Climbers. Yeah. So uh, like today we've just been up in the quarries. We've been climbing up at a place called Millstone. Uh, yeah, it's really good. You know from rock climbing. I do know rock climbing. I knew a rock climber once. Yeah. yeah. Who was it? We quite we know we know quite a lot of rock climbers, so maybe we we run into it. You probably haven't met this one. It's a horse. A ho climbing horse. A horse. Nah. Can't be a horse. You don't believe me, do you? Well, I mean, not. Tell us more. It was a horse. I'll tell you the tale if you have to. Now what you and your pretty little friend need to understand is that times were different back then. There was no face tube or you porn. Life was hard. If you didn't work, you didn't eat. And if you didn't eat, you'd be hungry. Now up at that quarry where you two have been climbing today, life didn't get much harder than if you were one of them horses. They'd have to take rock from one place to another and then back again. It was hard work. Made even harder, because they only had hooves. Come on, faster, I don't pay you. All day they'd have to work, always being watched by the evil quarry owner, an evil villain if ever there was one. Work harder. Handsome mind, but evil. Not hard enough! How am I ever going to afford my opium habit if you work this slowly? One day, during a rare rest break, this horse decided something. It's a hard life, working in these quarries. Day after day, hour after hour, minute after minute. All we do is work, work, work. And what do we get? Nothing. We should try and escape. Tonight. So, that very evening, the horse tried to escape. It snuck, sneakily, towards freedom. But it wasn't going to be all plain sailing, that's for sure. Ah, <sighs> guard duty is a bit of a bore. However, it does give me the opportunity to practice my whacking and I can count my money. I wonder if I've got enough for some opium. Not quite. Hold on a sec. Is that a horse? You're not escaping from my quarry today, you stupid horse. No, no! Try and escape from me, will you? The horse failed. Well, that didn't work, did it? Total shambles. The only way to get out of that quarry, death. We're going to have to climb. A climb? He had to climb. A climbing horse. A climbing horse, apparently. A climbing horse. That's right, a climbing horse. Can a horse climb? Can you climb? Can we climb? There's a slab. Over there, that looks easy. We should try it. Three, two, one, step. Yeah. Okay. Now, before you or your attractive friends say anything about ooh, a horse can't climb up a rock, this horse weren't built like your bog standard horse, was he? No, this one was built different. He was absolutely chock full of spunk, grit and determination. As a horse climbed higher and higher, he became more and more nervous on account of him being a horse climbing up a cliff. At one point, he almost totally fell apart. Luckily though, he managed to pull himself together and carry on up. The horse climbed higher and higher, all the way up the cliff. But unfortunately, there was no way to escape. So the horse, he climbed up a slab. 
because that was the best thing he thought for his hooves. He gave it a valiant effort, but he wasn't quite able to escape out of the quarry. Right. I see what you're thinking. What did he do next? Well, the only option he had then. You know what this means? We're going to have to go up Master's Edge. <laughs> yeah, we know Master's Edge. We do, yeah. It's the, uh, it's the local one up there. Have it's you ever imagined a horse climbing it? Imagine this. A horse climbed it. One thing you and your pretty mate may not have realised is that climbing's very hard for horses for one simple reason. Because of where their eyes are and how massive their noses are, they actually have a blind spot directly in front of them. Which, as you can imagine, makes rock climbing pretty difficult. One little fall wasn't going to stop our horsey hero from gaining his freedom. All that horse needed was just to get his front legs over the top and then his back legs would follow on after. And then, freedom. Or at least, that's what he thought. The man who owned the quarry, he saw the horse topping out at the top of Master's Edge and he chased him down the road. Hey, come back. Come back immediately. Stop it! Come back! Luckily, almost every horse in the world can outrun even the most handsome human man. Uh, what happened? Well, the horse managed to get away. How did it manage to get away? It hitchhiked. So you're saying a horse climbed up Master's Edge, escaped out the quarry and hitchhiked? That's exactly what I'm saying. So where did it hitchhike to? Where do you think? <laughs>